This is a quick demonstration of a new Map Proxy module, uh, which allows OpenAI's ChatGPT to uh, control an Ardor Pilot vehicle. Uh, so for those of you who aren't familiar with Map Proxy, it is a developer-focused uh, ground station, so a bit like Mission Planner or uh, Q Ground Control, but uh, more for use by developers. So it's got this new uh, chat screen here, and um, I can use this to um, you know, interact with uh, ChatGPT. So for example, I can ask it, uh, what vehicle am I using? Now that audio is sent off to uh, ChatGPT and it turns it into text. And then um, ChatGPT comes back and asks questions uh, which are forwarded onto the vehicle, the vehicle responds, etc. Anyway, so it just answered me saying that I'm using a copter. I can do, I can also just type it in. Uh, sometimes that's easier. So for example, I could ask, uh, you know, what's the vehicle's uh, current barometer and GPS altitude? A little bit of lag. I guess it's got to go off to California and back. There we go. So uh, vehicle's altitude is 947 meters, which is where I am, about sea level, and also uh, uh, gives me some uh, information on the barometer altitude as well. 1.158 meters above home. So um, yeah, then I can actually also control the vehicle. So uh, what I'm going to do next is ask it to uh, take off to three meters. Now to do this, it will need to switch to guided mode, arm the vehicle, and issue a takeoff command. So it's just asking me to confirm that that's what I want. And we can see down here on the map proxy screen, it has armed the vehicle. Propellers are spinning up oh, and it tried to take a takeoff command did not work. So let's just try that again. Just ask it to do it again. Maybe it'll be successful this time. Uh, it worked. There it goes. Okay, there it is. Now I'm going to ask it to rotate the vehicle 180 degrees. A little spelling mistake in there, but that's okay. It'll figure it out. So it commanded to rotate, but it didn't work. So let's just... Uh, Make it rotate north. There it is. Yeah, so it's rotated around north. Now I'm going to ask it to uh, move, uh, move two meters to the left. There it goes. Did that fine. I'm just going to ask it to uh, move back uh, two meters. And it should move south there. So it, it seems to be thinking the vehicle's facing north, but let's just ignore that for now. I think now I'll just ask it to RTL. Let me climb out of frame for a moment. Sorry about that. Then it's going to be coming home. You can see the one map. It's come home. So that's all good. Um, so in terms of how it works, uh, we've got uh, these assistants uh, which you can set up, and um, you know uh, the map pro proxy module is talking to these assistants. If you uh, open up these assistants, there's all kinds of 
you know, little special functions that we've set up to allow uh, ChatGPT to, uh, you know, send Mavlink commands, uh, read Mavlink commands, that kind of Mavlink messages, etc. Um, the use of this actually requires an API key. So um, we still haven't figured out how we're going to pass through the costs of using that to users. So for now, what we've done is we've um, uh, set up all these files so that you can create your or recreate your own um, assistant. Uh, so uh, you know you can you can set it up yourself. Um, and that's about it. I hope that's been useful.